skewness and kurtosis of distributions skewness is an indicator of lack of symmetry in a data the distribution can be symmetric positively skewed or negatively skewed consider these three diagrams this is symmetric you can see that it is almost symmetric in nature so it shows a symmetric distribution here in this diagram you can see that tail is towards the right side there is a long tail towards the right side and most of the data is concentrated around the left side so there is a peak, uh, the, it is concentrated around the left side and the tail is towards the right side. And this type of distribution shows positive skewness. It is positively skewed distribution. Positively skewed distribution. In this case, there is a long tail in the left side and most of the data are concentrated around the right side. So it indicates negative skewness it is a negatively skewed distribution negatively skewed distribution so based on the skewness we can uh, classify the distribution as symmetric distribution positively skewed distribution as well as uh, negatively skewed distribution and a skewness can be measured by using so many techniques one of such technique is called uh, Carl Pearson's method and the other method is Bolli's coefficient of skewness and uh, the values of skewness ranges from minus 1 to plus 1 the uh, lowest value is minus 1 and the highest value is plus 1 and it can take any value between minus 1 and plus 1 if it is less than 0 that is if it is negative distribution is negatively skewed and if the skewness is more than 0 or it, if it is positive the distribution is generally positively skewed another important concept is kurtosis it is an indicator of peakedness or flatness of a distribution it indicates the flatness of the curve at the top based on the peakedness we can classify the curves as normal curve leptocurtic curve and platycurtic curve This is a normal curve. It shows a platycurtic curve. This is sorry, leptocurtic curve. This is platycurtic curve. If a curve is more flatter than the normal curve, then it is called then it is called platycurtic. Platycurtic. If it is peak, uh, very peak, more than a normal curve, then it is called leptocurtic curve. So based on the peakedness or flatness, it is classified into three types. 
leptocurtic, platycurtic and normal curves.